For the first time in history, the United States is confronting two nuclear-powered adversaries, China and Russia. Both nations are continuously evolving their air defense systems. Therefore, the U.S. Air Force began planning for the sixth-generation Intercontinental Strategic Bomber B-21 Raider. Developed by Northrop Grumman, the aircraft's design is highly stealthy. The aircraft is outfitted with AI-powered sensors and weapon systems, allowing it to perform wide range of both conventional and nuclear missions. It will replace the aging B-1 and B-2 aircraft. While the specific information about the aircraft's capabilities and design are classified, we will aim to shed light on some of the aircraft's key features trickled down to the public. Number 1. The name Raider is intended to evoke the bravery and spirit of the World War II Doolittle Raiders. On April 18, 1942, Doolittle and his 16 B-25 crews took off from Hornet to conduct a surprise raid on Tokyo. This daring raid changed the course of the war in the Pacific Theater, resulting in the withdrawal of Japanese troops for home defense. While the B-21 designation signifies the Raider as the first bomber of the 21st century. I am very humbled to be here representing General Doolittle and the Raiders at the naming of the B-21 Raider and wish they were here. We are deeply honored. Thank you. Number 2. The technical details of the B-21 aircraft remain out of public view. However, as per the congressional report, the aircraft will be subsonic which means the aircraft's maximum speed will be less than 767 miles per hour, or simply less than the speed of sound. The aircraft is operated by a crew of two and is powered by Pratt and Whitney engines. The estimated range of B-21 is projected to exceed 6,000 miles, which enables the aircraft to conduct both conventional and nuclear strikes. The aircraft is expected to carry at least 30,000 pounds of payloads. The B-21 will also be armed with the latest long-range stealth missiles like Joint Air-to-Surface Standoff Missiles. As of today, the U.S. Air Force plans to purchase at least 100 aircraft with a per-unit cost of $692 million. Number 3. The B-21 is the world's first sixth-generation aircraft. The term sixth-generation aircraft refers to a class of aircraft that is expected to incorporate a range of advanced technologies, including stealth, highly advanced sensors, network-enabled warfare capabilities, and the ability to fly itself. The B-21 will be equipped with AI-powered sensors and autonomous systems, and potentially even can operate in space. Number 4. The design of the B-21 Raider is expected to feature a flying wing configuration, similar to that of the B-2 Spirit. It is expected to have a low radar cross-section, as well as other features that reduce its visibility to infrared, acoustic, and other sensors. The aircraft will surpass the B-2 Spirit's stealth capability and can evade the enemy's anti-access and area denial systems. The purpose of these systems is to create a protective bubble around air bases and naval ports. This bubble is created with the help of long-range missiles, air defense systems, cyber and electronic warfare capabilities. The B-21 will be able to defeat such sophisticated systems to penetrate and complete its missions. Number 5. The B-21 Raider will be a key component in the United States nuclear triad. The nuclear triad refers to the three methods by which a country can launch a nuclear attack, through aircraft, land, and submarine. The aim of a nuclear triad is to provide multiple delivery channels to enhance the effectiveness and survivability of a country's nuclear weapons. In this way, even if one system is destroyed, the other two systems can still be utilized to launch a nuclear attack. The B-21 will be able to deliver nuclear weapons to targets deep inside enemy territory, increasing the survivability and effectiveness of the U.S. nuclear arsenal. Number 6. Northrop Grumman refers to the B-21 as a digital bomber. 
The aircraft will have several digital systems and capabilities critical to carry out the most complex range of missions. Its AI-powered software can autonomously control the flight system, weapon system, and various other systems. Number 7. The B-21 will use cloud-based technologies to facilitate communication and data sharing among different parts of the aircraft and with other military systems. For instance, the ground system data will be stored in a cloud environment to access it over the network. This system will enable the aircraft to transmit and share vast amounts of data about the enemy during combat. Number 8. The Raider plays a crucial role in supporting the U.S. strategic deterrence strategy. The aircraft not only allows commanders to target any location worldwide, but it also serves as the primary component of a larger system that offers intelligence gathering, surveillance, electronic attack, and multi-domain networking capabilities. Number 9. The B-21 is based on open architecture, which means its design is flexible, modular, and adaptable, with the intention of making it easier to upgrade and modify over time. This means that the aircraft will not get blockwise improvements, in contrast to preceding generation aircraft. Rather, the aircraft's software updates and built-in hardware flexibility will enable the seamless integration of new technology, capabilities, and weaponry. By doing this, the B-21 will be able to confront the evolving threats head-on for decades to come. Number 10. The Raider is expected to play a key role in ensuring the future air dominance of the U.S. Air Force. Its advanced data fusion, sensor, and weapon integration will mark a new chapter in terms of capability and adaptability. Some defense experts believe it to be one of the most capable aircraft in the skies. Overall, the B-21 Raider will play a critical role in maintaining the credibility and effectiveness of the U.S. nuclear triad. With its impressive capabilities, it will serve as a deterrent to potential adversaries, contributing to the protection of the United States and its allies. So, what do you think about the United States 6th generation B-21 Raider? Let us know in the comments section. Also, be sure to check out our other videos. Thanks for watching, and as always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.